Frugal friends, welcome back. So we started with the Timu doll bunk bed at Christmas in the doll house makeover that we've been working on. And Chelsea and Tommy liked it just fine for sleeping, but they agree with Mariah and I that it does not match their colorful bedroom and they would be far more comfortable with some blankets, pillows, and mattresses. I started with an orange base over the whole thing to match the bedroom, but with plans for far more than just this. I'm almost done painting the whole thing orange and probably do one more coat over the whole thing and then hopefully the collection of paints will get here and then I can start on the detail work. Mariah asked me to have the ladder and the stairs be white. I did go ahead and coat them and paint them and uh oh got some orange on that. But I am painting everything, even if we are keeping it the original color, because the paint, to me, in my opinion, adds like texture and stuff, and to me, makes it look more like it's like actual wood or something rather than just um, plastic. Plus, it's fun and I enjoy it. So, okay, we have everything orange. I, I really do think I need to do like one more coat across the whole thing, let that dry, and then do another coat on the white, scrape that orange off, recoat that. And then these, well, the latter I think will be done if I can stop, yeah, spraying orange, flicking orange paint on it on accident. Um, I don't know. I am tempted to do like the... Um, the fronts of the stairs or these little handles that are supposed to be little drawers, maybe painting those with a different color. I'll have to ask Mariah. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, still sick. <clears throat> I'll get her thoughts on that. Plus, the other colors haven't arrived yet anyway, so it's fine. But it might be fun to do that or even little pictures or I don't I don't know I don't know most likely those will just stay white other than maybe the handles but the rest of this you see all these little details they're just begging for I don't know some kind of something something fun something whimsical and uh, that's right up my alley so we shall see what happens okay so I am done with the orange base coat uh, definitely on the bunk bed I probably I'm going to do one more coat on this portion of it, but I wanted to show you guys the paints came. <laughs> so many fabulous colors, and Mariah and I looked at them yesterday. She picked out which colors she wants me to use to do, like, accents and stuff. She's like, Mom, that orange is way too bright or too, like, much, and I, I promised her it's... Sorry, I have a mouth guard right there. That's random. Um, <laughs> real life. This is real life. Um, anyway... I said, no, that's just the base coat. We're going to do accents and stuff. And then one fun thing that she asked um, if she could contribute is doodles. So, you know, kids draw on their beds, put stickers on their beds, things like that that drive us parents crazy. But it is realistic. And so we picked a couple of spots where she's going to use some of the very fine tipped brushes. And she is going to do some doodles uh, so that, you know, it's like the kids did some doodles there. And then... I will try to get all of this um, detail painting done today, and then tomorrow, hopefully, her and I can go ahead and make the mattresses, uh, bed sheets, blankets, and pillows.
is thrilled with the colors. That makes me so happy. The one thing that I am running into is the mistake of not having taped off this area when I was putting the green. So now I'm having to do layers and layers and layers of orange paint to tidy that up. Could I just put like a ruffle here? Yes, maybe, except that these, like this ladder goes right here. Yeah, I probably still could. I don't know. I'm going to like, because we still have to do the mattresses and pillows. So I don't know. I'll try like two or three more layers just because I'm stubborn like that, and uh, oh, it'll, it'll be fine eventually, one way or the other. But that's where we're at right now. That is uh, the update, and I'm going to leave it here. And when we bring you back, we will be 100% done with the painting process, and we will be working on the mattresses, blankets, and pillows. But for those, we've got to get the stuff down from the attic, and I'm just not quite, not this close to feeling not dizzy enough to get up there and give that a whirl so anyway till then we'll see you all well we'll see you then how about that bye bye real quick p.s i found uh, a solution for my little perfectionist issue right here white paint i was touching up over here on the stairs because there's a couple of spots and then i was like let me just try putting white over the green yeah covers it right up how about that so i'll let that dry and then go over that with orange and then silly thing that i thought of you know what the green that i was trying to do here on the edge we're not even going to see that anyway because of the mattress and the blankets like that was that was pointless but we learn as we go anyway this this is going to save me having to do like 25 layers of orange